Thanks for tuning in. Again, my name is Nathan going over the Forest River Cherokee Black Label, the 274 WK Black Label Edition. Um, this unit's going to have the Black Label package. It's going to be uh, like solid surface countertops, a couple other amenities. Uh, big one's going to be fiberglass on the unit. This is going to be like a rear living setup. You're going to have two recliners, dinette on a slide, and then you're going to have a big kitchen slide right across from that with the entertainment center right there on it. Those two opposing slides really going to open up that living quarters be able to check that out here in a second on the walkthrough um, unit is about 7100 pounds dry so very lightweight friendly along with coming in here at 33 feet two inches overall Thanks for joining us here today, folks. My name is Nathan Anderson. Going to be going over um, the 2023 Cherokee 274 WK BL, BL's Black Label Edition. I'm going to have a nice front cap here, complete with the Cherokee style graphics, marking lights on both sides. They put the diamond plate down here. Um, I'd rather, you know, the rocks, the debris, um, you know, the, the road tar get kicked up on this uh, rather than your nice fa uh, fancy front cap here. Gonna have your battery box, 12 volt deep cycle. Uh, there's plenty of room up here that you guys can put a second battery and a second battery box right up in there. Two 20 pound propane tanks, gonna have your auto switch over valve in the center. Don't have to worry about switching the tanks. And then you guys do have your power tongue front jack. No more hand cranking, makes it super easy. Over here is gonna be your complete with your pass-through storage. That goes clear to the other side there um, and even up into where the bed would be at. Lots of storage underneath there. All of your uh, solar charge controllers right there. You guys can press a button, see what percentage go into the battery, how much battery you got left. Up here, um, Cherokee did two style, uh, two awnings here on this coach. One right here over the entry door, and then another one kind of where the big game would be playing at, where the family would be hanging out at. They also do uh, a blue light. Cherokee did some research, figured out that insects aren't attracted to blue light as much as they are in other color. So they do the blue to help cut down on that. 2023s did that kind of like a cool logo, um, lighted up with a blue LED again on that. Solid um, steps here, those will fold up. Easy to just uh, stow away in there for travel. Over here on the big slide outside, you're gonna have a TV mount. That's gonna be the same mount, the one indoors. Uh, you can hang it right there, watch the game. Cherokee puts your uh, audio speakers at listening level. They don't put them up high. You know, that sound's not drowning, going above your head, going to the other uh, campsite. Right here at eye level at listening height. Um, very good sound quality there. Over here on the back side of the camper, you guys are gonna have your uh, leash hitch kind of thing here that tie up your uh, dog, cat, whatever. And then you can also lock down your grill with a chain, anything you guys don't want to be taken from the campsite if you guys were to leave. Cherokee does the drop down storage rack here. Uh, you pull a pin, this pin right here, take the cotter pin out, pop that pin, do it on the other side. That flips down, tons of storage there above that. You're gonna have your uh, Cherokee backup camera. That camera comes standard. Don't have to purchase anything. You actually use your cell phone as the viewing monitor. Now to the kitchen area of this coach, guys. Uh, black Label Edition is gonna be solid surface countertops. That's one of the amenities of the Black Label. Solid surface, you can cut on it. It's not porous, um, doesn't hold spills and stains and smells. Take off the sink covers there, black stainless steel, big farmhouse house, uh, style sink. You can throw a big pot and pan in there, don't have to worry about the divider hitting you. Do have a pull down uh, style faucet here. This is a Cherokee uh, sanitizer station, essentially just a, a soap pump and you guys can put soap in there, whatever you wanna do. Below here, tons of storage below. Tons of these drawers, um, three drawers on that side, three drawers, two big pole uh, cabinets here, lots of storage on the island. Behind you there, you're gonna have a nice vent, attic fan, um, right above kind of where you guys would be cooking at. Over here, 110 outlets to plug stuff in, uh, three burner cooktop, convection microwave, along with your normal style of oven. Over here is going to be your uh, Canon style black stainless steel 12 volt refrigerator. That'll run off the solar panel, that'll run off your tow vehicle's battery going down the road. Um, lots of ways to run that, lasts for a very long time, compressor driven, just like the one in your fridge and your uh, 
home is. Over here, big deep pantry style setup. Over here, you guys might notice that this is the same style that's on the outside for a TV hanger. Like I said, just take this TV, hang it up on the outside. Over here is all of your head unit controls, Bluetooth, what speakers you want it to play out of. Below that is your guys' electric fireplace. Puts out a good amount of heat. Nice to take that chill off on a nice cold day if you guys are still camping. Uh, speaker here and then a, behind me right here they do a, a subwoofer here to enhance the sound a little bit behind me over here this is a zebra style blackout shade so you guys can do that that'd be normal or you guys can do full blackout which would be that so kind of cool really like those zebra shades below that's a jackknife this will fold flat a uh, spot for somebody to sleep at 110 outlets both sides lots of storage over here across from the kitchen slides, another opposing slide in a living room. So again, two big slides open up. That leaves tons of room here in the living quarters. Uh, two nice recliners here, zebra shades behind there, accent lighting, um, mushroom style lights to come off or on if you guys use a light switch. Over here, um, they're generous enough to give you some dinette storage. That slides the whole entire length of dinette. Um, give plenty of room here to stow away some more stuff. That table will lay down. These will go behind on top of the table. Uh, another spot for you know, two small children to sleep, one grown adult, and then your slide room controls just right over there. Now to the master bathroom here of the coach. You guys notice right behind me, nice mirror, nice storage behind the mirror. Uh, and they do a black stainless steel faucet, hot and cold knobs, 110 outlets for straighteners, uh, blow dryers, wherever you guys need to plug in there. Big um, deep bowl sink here, storage down below it. Over here on this side, nice foot flush style toilet. They put this in a nice position. You know, your feet aren't hanging out of the doorways, getting in the way of things. You guys can still close both doors. Coat hangers over here. On this side of me is going to be the, the tub. They give um, a nice skylight here. I mean, that's about four to five inches. Additional headroom for the taller people. You can control how the water comes out too. So the water can come out of the shower head. It can also come down over here and kind of hit you directly. Or you have a uh, separate faucet um, handle here that you guys can use to wash with. Now to the master bedroom here of this coach. Um, right off the top here, you notice overhead storage. You also notice big deep um, style his and hers uh, wardrobes. You can hang clothes up here. Flat storage, um, that'd be probably be for like a sleeping machine. Gonna have two USBs, 110 outlets. Also have these cool little reading lights too that you can control with a button. And then this bed does lift up. Um, tons of storage underneath it there too. And then right to the left of me over there is your guys' TV backer for TV. Um, nice big stud behind there. Put a uh, arm, TV hanger arm right there. Cable inlets, 110 outlets right above your head. Thanks for sticking with me today here, folks. Again, my name is Nathan Anderson. I can be reached here at the dealership six days a week, 937-649-5823.